What up guys, Shifty here, back at it again with another review and today we're gonna review the custom Datsun 240Z sent in by Storm Riders Wheels and check this out, oh boy I love this car. I couldn't find this car in Singapore and uh, when Storm Riders was planning to send me an RAOK, I actually saw an Instagram story, story of him where he found this car on the pegs and I was really really happy because I've been, I, I did tell him that I was looking for this car. He told me like, hey Jifter, what car are you looking for? I'm gonna try to find them and yes, thankfully he did find this car and I do appreciate it. I think among all of the cars he sent me, uh, I'm not I'm not saying that this is necessarily the nicest, but this one is has the most meaning to it because Luke took uh, took a step, uh, took an extra step into finding this car for me for the RA. Okay, so once again, a shout out goes to Storm Riders Wheels for sending me this car right here. But enough about the story behind the car. How about the car itself? So check this out. Uh, the the Fugu Z, nice uh, body kit. <laughs> At least it looks like just it came directly straight from Need for Speed, so that's really nice. There are no front light tempos, but I just get a rear uh, front scoop right there. And the only tempos that this car has are the rear light tempos. So you can see Fugu Z rear light tempos and a Grady license plate on the rear of the car. It also has an orange plastic base to act as the front scoop and the rear bumper of the car. I wish that given given this car it is front light tempos, you know. This car doesn't already have any stripes or racing sponsors or vinyls on, on any parts of the car. So some front light tempos would have been nice, you know. So uh, yeah, sadly they didn't include it. Uh, but anyways, it is a really nice orange paint on this one. I love it. I'm happy to have add this into my collection. So yeah, once again, this is the Fugu Z. And from a scale of 1 to 10, I, I have to... I have to give this car a 9 out of 10. If it had frontline temples, I would have given it a perfect score.